Max, you've had a little bit of time now to kind of think about and reflect this incredible year that you've had. What did it mean to you and your teammates to, to put together that incredible run? Yeah, you know, it was a lot of fun. You know, I, I think in the, you know, guys that have been at TCU for the last three or four years, had, you know, we, we struggled a little bit, didn't have the success on the field that we wanted to. So I think to have, you know, this season to go play for a national championship, it means so much for the players, coaching staff, our community, TCU. It was uh, pretty special for us. I was there for uh, those playoff games. Um, was there a pinch me moment when you look back now, one of those moments where you said, man, this was, this was really incredible stuff. Yeah, I think, you know, if you go back and reflect just, you know, running out in the tunnel for the, you know, Fiesta Bowl for, for the national championship of understanding of where you're at and what you're playing for and what you've been through and, and where you're at at a place that you love to be at, I, it was, you know, pretty special. What do you think you will remember most? Was it that, that moment when you got to run out there? Yeah, I, I think moments like that. I think just even smaller moments of, of with the guys, you know, whether it was on the bus, whether it's eating lunch, um, in the locker room after practice. I think it's those moments that you're really going to remember. Now you got a pro day coming up. you got the combine coming up. So you kind of got to switch gears and start thinking about your next career in front of you. What do you want to show the NFL scouts and coaches that Max Duggan can do? I think just go be um, a great leader of men, go be a consistent football player, uh, be able to be a face of a franchise. I think that's what you really want, you know, a guy that you can trust and a guy that will, um, you know, do his, his job and, and perform on Sunday. So. How do you go about that? What's that process like? Because I know there's a lot more work that goes on behind the scenes than people would ever think. Yeah, you know, there, there's a lot of, um, you know, small things uh, that you need to go train for, you know, whether it's even for combine of run to 40, you know, working on your mechanics, the development, interview prep. And I think uh, there's just a lot of just belief in yourself uh, that you can be a guy for a franchise for 15 years, and that's what everybody wants to be, and that's the goal. Now, when it comes to the Davey O'Brien Award, you've heard about this quarterback, what he means to TCU, the national championship back in 1938. How does that elevate the way you feel about receiving this award? Yeah, it means so much. You know, to be the first recipient from TCU, it means so much to so many people in our community and in our city because you get to share this moment w with everyone that's helped, you know, support you. And we understand, you know, what Davey O'Brien did for TCU and our program and for Fort Worth, so it's pretty special to be a part of. Now, your dad was a college quarterback. Your mom ran track in college. Your dad was a longtime football coach. What did they tell you along your way that you think prepared you most for all these big moments that you've, that you've handled so well? Yeah, I, I think always be humble. I think there's no substitution for, for hard work and competition. You know, a lot of tough love that, you know, I, I got from them. And, and I think that really helped me for a lot of the moments in, in my career, whether it was success, whether it was failures, things off the field. I think they helped me and supported me, you know, through it all. You have created a standard at TCU with the way you guys played. Um, as these uh, players and, and other teams come behind you, what do you want them to think that standard is that you set? Yeah, they, there are so many great players before us that you know set that standard, and I think just you know again going out there and compete, being a tough group. Uh, I think that's what TCU is known for, kind of being the the smaller guy that people don't really give credit for, and I think. Um, you know, yeah, competing and being tough and gritty, um, getting everything that, that, you know, we deserve. I, I think that's what, you know, the culture that we're, we're trying to set and move forward. Where does the toughness come from? Because we all know just how tough you had to be. Is it mom? Is it dad? Yeah, it's probably from uh, both of them, maybe yeah. a little bit about where I grew up and, you know, the city. Uh, I think just kind of that, that grit, that, that toughness kind of comes from that. There he is, Max Duggan. Thanks so sure. much, man. Yeah, Appreciate thank the you. time. Thank you.